Hello lovely people, welcome to the Geek Cupboard, I'm Penge, and welcome to Dome Romantic, which is a game all about exploiting the resources of an alien world for our own personal gain, which I think means that we're playing as the bad guys, which is all very intriguing indeed. So yes, we have a dome on an alien world, and under that dome we dig into the planet to find various useful bits and bobs, so minerals or whatever we find under the ground, but the native creatures understandably don't like us at all, they don't like what we're doing, which is absolutely fair enough, so we have to defend ourselves and our dome by deploying various weapons and shields and all that kind of stuff. It looks really interesting. It looks very, very intriguing indeed. So I thought we should definitely check it out and have a little play. Now, this is the demo of the game, so it's not the finished version. And as I record this right now, the demo is available on Steam. So if you're interested, there is a link to the Steam store page in the video description below. If you want to go and check it out, then you can do so. But without any further ado, I think let's get on with it, shall we? Let's go and exploit an alien world. Okay, so the first thing we have to do is choose our dome, which I do quite like. However, because we're in the demo, we only have one dome available. But fortunately for us, the dome we have available is the laser dome, which does sound very, very good indeed. I mean, if we were going to pick a dome that could, you know, maybe shoot at baddies, I think the laser dome is quite a good choice. So, yep, it's like a classic dome with a pointy bit on the top. And then I guess as you play the game and you get certain achievements or goals or whatever, you then unlock all these other domes. So that one there looks a little bit more sort of bubbly, if you like, with a sort of a lollipop type thing in it. This one here has got all sorts of kind of jaunty angles going on. This one here looks a little bit like a kind of jelly, a sort of jelly mold type dome. And I don't know what's going on with this dome at all, but I like it a lot. It's got all sorts of crazy things happening to it. But alas, we can't pick any of these. So we will go for the laser dome. Thank you so much. And then we need to pick a game mode. Okay, so we can either dig through a big planet's crust and reach its core, or we can go and sort of plunder lots of little planets. I think we'll go for a core dig. Let's try and go and dig into a planet's core and find all sorts of exciting goodies. So we'll pick a core mode and then select a difficulty. So you've got hard but doable or brutal. Okay, so it says here, this is the intended normal difficulty, very challenging or hard but doable, a good choice for your first runs. Yeah, I think we might go on that so we can get more resources from slightly softer ground and there's a little more time between waves and monsters and all that kind of stuff. Okay, yeah, we shall play on hard but doable, please. I think that might be our kind of limit. Okay, so here we go. Now we're playing as this character over here, sort of, you know, scooting about the place and this is our wonderful dome and we're on a planet that looks sort of very purpley. There is a moon in the sky. So yeah, we can fly about the place. Now, right now, all we have in our dome is this kind of thing that we're flying around in front of now, which is kind of like a resource sort of eating type thing. And then we've got a little sort of control deck over here. So if we go into there, we kind of sit down at the computer and we can either upgrade ourselves or our dome or we can go to battle. So this is how we do our fighting right now, because the pointy thing on the top is a laser because of course we have a laser dome so that moves around and then we can shoot lasers at things which is all very exciting indeed so when the monsters do come along we can at least try and defend ourselves a bit but right now no monsters kind of coming around the place so we have to go down here so this is where we're going to go. We're going to pop down here and then to mine things, we just kind of just bash into them. We just kind of equip a little mining tool and just bash into things. And there we go. We're picking up resources already. So this green stuff is what we want. So then I think we have to kind of latch onto it using this and then we bring it up. We fly it back into the dome. We chuck it into that kind of resource eating thing of a jig and then we get some resources. So let's grab that bit as well and we'll throw that into there. Now I did do a little sort of trial run of this just to kind of get the hang of the very basics. And there was a very, very useful upgrade. So there's quite a lot of upgrades. There are many, many things. So you can upgrade the dome, you can upgrade the laser, or you can upgrade yourself. So you can make yourself move quicker or drill things quicker or whatever. And there's loads, look how far along it goes. It's really, really kind of detailed. So I think we want to get the hostile proximity meter displays the time until hostile life arrives at the dome because you don't know necessarily when there's a big kind of monster thing going to come to attack you because you might be down you know digging in the earth and then you come back up and find your dome all smashed so we kind of need to buy that so that takes two green thingamajigs now after we've got that we could do with buying the inventory thing as well to display the stored resources because i'm not entirely sure what we've got i think we've got three of the green kind of things that we found so okay so we shall buy one of those there we go so come out of that and now we can see in the bottom left hand corner oh hang on a minute i'm doing shooting hang on in the bottom left corner there is a sort of little sort of ticking down green bar so when that gets to the bottom 
we know that some monsters are going to turn up on the surface and try and knock the dome down. So we just need to keep sort of digging. Now when we dig around these top levels here, it's a lot easier. The earth falls apart significantly easier. Like if we dig up here, it's two hits, is it? Yeah, it's two hits to get rid of the earth over here. The only thing I don't know is how far left and right does it go? Is it just what's at the screen? Ah, hang on a minute. Right, we'll grab that now, but I think we need to get back and defend. So if we just pick this up now, chuck that into there. Right, there we go. And then pop into this. And now we're going to get ready to shoot a monster. So the camera kind of pans back. There we go. And it's a weird sort of wibbly looking thing. And it might get hit on. Right, so it does try to break the dome. I think it got one hit in. But that's it. There we go. So that's our sort of first wave of monsters dealt with. Right. We just dig these all out. We might as well just get the top layer kind of dug because why not? So there we go. So grab that and pick up both of those things and then, oh no, hang on. We haven't got the other one. Oh, hang on, hang on. How do we, how do we get them both? There we go. Right. So pick these up and hold them over. Now, because we're carrying some stuff, we do move a little bit slower. So chuck them in. So now in upgrades, can we get the inventory so we can see what we've got? Yes, I think we can. Okay, right, so now we've got two green things and no round things and no square things. Okay, this is, this is fine. Um, okay, that displays the dome's structural integrity. Do we need to know that right now? I would rather save up some of the green things so we can like make ourselves a little bit better. I think that's probably what we want to do. Okay, right, so we pop out of here. Now already, look, some time has passed. Some time has passed while I've been sat, you know, fiddling about on the computer. So we need to kind of get on with the digging side of things. Is there anything over here? Nope, unfortunately not. Right, so we're just going to come around this way. And are we going to find anything? Right, more green stuff. Hooray for the green stuff. Okay, this is good because we can use all of these resources. The only thing is, do we try and grab... Ooh, oh, there's loads of green stuff. Okay, oh, that's too many. That's too many. We need to get back up and defend quick. <laughs> quick. A big monster thing is going to come along and try and break our dome. Right in there. And let's get ready to do some battling. Which direct... Oh, it's coming in on the other side. Hang on a minute. Hang on. <laughs> right. It got some hits in. But now we're just blasting it with a laser. Okay. And it kind of explodes. Okay. Right. So that wasn't great because it was on the other side to where the pointy thing was. Maybe in the future we need to position the pointy thing at the top of the dome. So we can kind of, you know, sort of point it to where the baddies are. Because we don't quite know where they come in. Right, so if we grab some of those. Hang on, drop one of those. Because it's too heavy right now. So we'll then poodle back up here. Ah, oh, we're very slow. So grab that. And then go back down here. Pick up the final two green thingamajigs. So yeah, drop that down there. Then pick them both up. And then we can see, so we will have eight green things. I don't quite know what the green things are. Green ore or something. I don't know. Right, so we've got eight of those. So in terms of upgrades, can we do anything for ourselves now? So drill strength increases the drill strength to dig faster and we can move quicker. I think we buy that and we buy the buy both those. So we can drill things quicker and we can move about faster. Okay, so hang on, hang on. Can we put the drill thing back at the top as well? There we go. Right, so now how quick do we move? Ah, okay. We are a little bit faster, which is very handy. And of course, we need to be a bit faster because there are going to be points where we're going to be quite far away. We're going to be sort of quite distant. Um, oh, hang on. We need to get back up to the top to do some defending. Hang on a second. I imagine at some point we can have sort of automated defenses or whatever. Right, where is the monster coming in from? Deploy the big... Oh, there's two monsters. Oh, they're getting very sneaky, the monsters. Yeah, I imagine that you can deploy sort of automated defences or whatever, rather than you having to be there all the time. But okay, that monster did cause some damage to our dome there. So we have taken a little bit of damage, which is unfortunate, but never mind. Right, let's keep digging. Let's clear this bit out. Oh, there's some more under here. This is very good. We're picking up lots of thingamajigs. Right, let's take all of these four in one trip. Ah, uh, yeah, we're going quite slowly. It's very heavy. Right, right, just get up through the tunnely thing into the dome. Home, sweet home. Right, the resource eating thing can chew through all those. And yeah, we know there's nothing kind of round here. So why don't we go across this way? Oh, more green. Oh, there's so much green stuff everywhere. It's very good. Right, dig through here and dig through there. Anything on this side? No. Okay, so I think 
I think we'll have time to grab uh, all of that. Oh, will we have time to grab all of the green stuff? We might do. Oh, it's very heavy. Do you know what? I don't think we can. I think we, do you know what? We'll grab three, three bits, throw that in. And can we get back down and pick up the two before the aliens arrive? I'm going to say aliens. We're technically the aliens in this situation. Before the locals arrive and try and, you know, sort of defend their home, which does seem entirely justified. Right, okay. Are they going to come from two different directions again? Ah, no, they've come from the same direction. They are still getting some hits in. I think possibly we might want to make our laser a bit better. We should, I think have some things to spend now so hang on so if we go to upgrades um can we make this better okay so power one greatly improves the power of the laser ah but it will move slower when firing okay that's not great and we need to find some cobalt to repair the dome okay i think laser sight's no use because we can see where the laser's targeting because it's a massive laser it's not difficult it's got a big line i think Let's make it more powerful. And then if we find three more green things, we will try our best to, um, yeah, upgrade the speed of the laser as well, right? Let's just dig down this way. Look, we'll clear a path through the middle like that. And then, yeah, let's just go down this way. Oh, that's useful. Aha, right. I have no idea what any of this stuff is, but yes, we will take it. Thank you very much. Right, take this. That's one big block of something and one small block of something. So if we chuck that into the resource ET type thingamajig, pick a gadget, a stun laser. Install a laser that stuns small monsters automatically or monster repellent. Install a small bubble onto the dome containing a repelling liquid. Activate to release the repellent, delaying the arrival of the next wave. And it uses those round things. I quite like the idea of the, of the stun laser. Hang on, hang on, how do we, how do we pick one? Oh, okay, right. The, the, the outline is very faint. Let's get the stun laser. There we go. So now do we have two lasers? Oh, yeah, we have. We've got two lasers. Okay, I don't know how I'm going to manage that. <laughs> oh, dear me. I can barely manage one uh, dome laser, let alone two. Right, we could do as well with improving our kind of drill type thing. That'd be quite good. Hang on. Let's just dig a way back up just in case we need it. Okay, ammo, green stuff. That's very good. Oh, lots of green. Oh, so much green stuff. All of the green stuff is here. Right, grab a little bit of it, like that, and just dig up like that. There we go. Right, take a little bit of this and put that up there like that, and then get in the seat. Uh, okay, so now we've got move, and sh how do we? But how do we do the other laser? Hang on. So if we do that, oh yeah. Right, they both move. Oh, there's a, there's one in the sky. <laughs> oh, crikey's. Oh, they, ah, that one, that one's automated. The little stun laser is an automated thing that just moves around on its own. Oh, that's very exciting. Okay, so the laser is more powerful, but yeah, it is significantly slower. Okay, is that it? Are we done? I think we might be done. Okay, right, back we go. More green things to collect. So here we go. Let's go and get the green stuff. And again, knock a few holes over there. And over here, it won't take too long. Okay, that should make it easier to get this stuff out. Now, can we latch on to all of this and move? No. Okay, that's just going to take forever. So, bring this back. But you see, now the problem is we're getting further and further away from the dome. So, it's taking an awfully long time to bring the resources back. So, do we invest in ourselves a little bit now and try and get sort of you know, a little bit quicker and make the drill a bit better and what have you? And maybe, yeah, if we're carrying something, do you want to upgrade that as well? Right, okay, so chuck that in there. Go back in tier, do upgrades. Um, so I think, I mean, carry strength one is four. Hang on, can we repair the dome? Can we do that? No, ah, we haven't got a big, okay, right, we havenven't got the repairing dome thing. Um, so yeah, ooh, oh, the stun laser's got a thing as well now. Oh, the whole new thing opened up. Oh, crikey's. Okay, right, well, let's give ourselves a little bit of extra carry strength and that's kind of our first tier of upgrades done for ourselves and then we've got six uh six green things remaining so let's get the laser moving a bit quicker that makes perfect sense okie doke right so come out of that back we go let's go and do some digging as quick as we can uh we'll kind of go over here oh a thing ah right we can repair the dome we can repair the dome okay this is good so now we're going to go and do that pretty much straight away because the dome is a little bit broken around the edges. So hang on. 
So, repair the dome. Okay, so what does that look like? It's it's all sparkly and shiny and new. That's wonderful. Right, can we go and do a very quick bit of digging? Just get rid of some of that stuff. Just get out of the way. Right, hang on. Oh, no. Oh, no. We, we, we dug too deep. We dug too greedily. Right, hang on a minute. And right, this way. So zap that thing. That thing can go. But now that one's going to get a hit in. Oh, there's a sky one. There's a sky one. We're being targeted by the sky. Right, hang on a minute. It's been stunned. So now we can blast it with this. I like, yeah, a targeting laser. I don't need the targeting laser. I can see where the laser's going. <laughs> it's a laser. It's got a big wibbly line. Um, okay, right. The dome took a few hits, but I think we will be fine. Okay, where did we find that exciting stuff? Where was that? Whatever it is. The stuff that we just found that wasn't the green stuff. Over here, I think it was. So if we sort of dig over here, maybe. Let's sort of dig through the middle here. We need a better drill, I think. I think we might want to look at upgrading our drill. Uh, oh, we're finding hardly anything now. It's getting very tough to dig through things. Okay, how, let's go this way. Let's go this way. More, right, more green stuff. Green stuff is good. But then is this the edge? I think that might be the edge. Oh, no, that's not the edge. Is that the edge? No, nope, that's not the edge either. Right, okay. Let's keep going over here until we get to the edge. Ah, okay. More of that stuff which we can use to repair the the uh, dome, I think. I like how they sort of spin around as you pull them, as they sort of roll along the surfaces. That's quite nice. Right, here we go. Do our best kind of Superman thing. Up, there we go. And then, oh, hang on. No, we haven't got time. We haven't got time to go digging. Let's get ready for a bit of a fight. So here we go. We'll be prepared this time. Look at this. We'll be prepared for the natives. Okay, and it's going that way. So, pew. Oh, missed it a little bit. Right, shoot that. And then shoot the sky monster. So get rid of that. Oh, crikey. Right, hang on. And back around this way. And shoot you. And shoot you. And is that it? No, no, no. There's another one. Thank you, stun laser. <laughs> that was very helpful. Is there another one? And I think that's it. Okay, right. Good. Back down we go. Back down into the depths. And yeah, we can get the green thing. We've not got any green stuff kind of in storage anymore because we've used it all. So is there any more green stuff? There is. Okay. All right. Is there any more green? Oh, there's so much green stuff. Okay. This is wonderful. More green stuff. Let's clear that out of the way. Clear that out of the way just to make it easier to kind of get this to get access to this stuff. So do that. Clear that. Clear the one underneath it. Then clear the one above it. And then we're going to have to make multiple trips by the look of it. Oh, hang on. I think we can take one more. So there we go. We'll grab, no, I want three. <laughs> grab many. Uh, yeah, three. That'll do. And then fly back up. Have we got time? It's going to be a bit hit and miss. I think we might have time for one quick trip, as long as I don't mess it up. Although now I'm not sure we do have time. Hang on a minute. It's very far away. <laughs> right. Grab the stuff. Oh, no. Stun laser, come and help us. Right, okay. Here we go. Yeah, that sort of timer indicator thing down the bottom left, that's kind of crucial. That's the first thing you have to get, really. Or else I don't know how you'd know what you were doing. Because how would you know you were being attacked unless you popped up to have a look? Uh, right, okay. Shooty the monsters and shooty the monsters. Oh, there's another monster coming on the other side. You sneaky sausages. Right, okay. So shoot that one and shoot that one. Oh, now they're firing at us from the sky. Right, get rid of that one. Oh, Okay, doing a weird kind of uh, vampire bat type thing. Okay, is that it? Stun laser, are you moving around? No, you're not. Okay, so now we go back down here and we do the final bit of digging. Oh no, hang on, we've got these green things, haven't we? So let's grab two more green things. Can we do some upgrades with the green things? It might be a good idea to do so. So let's lob those into there and go and have a look at upgrades. Um, I mean, the health meter is quite useful, but I'm thinking we've got eight green things. So how about we upgrade... I mean, what's going to be better? The jetpack or the drill? I think let's upgrade the jetpack so we can actually move quicker because as we dig deeper, we're becoming further and further away from our kind of dome. So we need to move a little bit quicker. Oh, there we go. That's quite nice. And then if we get eight more green things, we'll upgrade the... Um, the drill we'll upgrade the diggy drill because it is taking a while to get through this kind of you know sort of deep earth now right there's something there 
We will have a bit of this. I don't know what this is, but okay. Can we grab it all? Is that possible? Can we move? Ooh, yes, we can. We can grab all of this and still move around at relatively fast speeds. Okay, this is good. Uh, right. What can we do with all that? Um, the dome is looking a little bit kind of broken, so let's let the resource chewing thing do its job. Um, we have got... Uh, yeah, we've got a bit of cobalt. Is that what that is then? The kind of box must be cobalt. So we'll repair the dome. But then what can we do with the round thing? Ah, they're kind of part of other kind of upgrades. Okay. Oh, crikey. Yeah, there's loads of things. But yeah, they're more to do with the laser. Primary, as we flick around the maps, uh, the upgrade tree. Sorry about that. Um, oh, hang on. What's that? Autonomy. A simple AI will activate the stun laser even when you are not inside the control station. Two of the round things. Okay, yeah, we'll buy that. Thank you very much. There we go. That will help quite a bit. Um, now, do we do we just pop back out and do a bit of digging? Tight, let's just dig some pointless stuff. Just clear this out of the way. Away with you rubbish bits. Just get rid of that. Get rid of that. Right, back up we go to the defense mode. Okay, so battle. Go to here. Big fight thing's going to happen. It's going to happen over there. Right, stun laser's doing a good job. Right, Get around this way. We're probably going to take a hit or two. Yep, it's bashing us on the uh, on the dome there. Back we go this way. Right, where are the flying things? I'm expecting flying things. Oh, they're attacking kind of either side, side to side now. Um, okay, hang on, hang on. We've got... There's that one gone. So shoot that. And then we've got you just there. Killity kill. Is that it? Is that it? Yep, yeah, okay, right. That's it. Back we go. Back we go down into the depths. Just take that out as we go. Right, is there anything else down here? What we could do, what we could do, thinking about it. There's a whole big load of stuff over here. Ah, there we go, look. We haven't investigated over here. So we could grab some of this. Okay, there we go. Ah, look at that. Oh, there's there's loads of stuff. Okay, right, that was worth doing. So hang on, can we grab all of this stuff? Can we grab every single bit and just haul it up? Yep, yeah, okay. We are certainly trying our best. It's very big and very heavy, but... We can do it. Come on. Come on, little green spacesuity person. Um, yeah, is that going to be another upgrade? That big box thing, I think, is a sort of upgrade, isn't it? So if we just chuck all those into there. Right, pick a gadget. A shield or a lift. Install a shield that will absorb some damage, recharges automatically, or a lift, install a lift, that automatically moves mined resources into the dome. Oh, they're both really good. Why can we only have one? I think let's get a lift so we can just keep digging and just chuck the resources into the lift. So then we can go back up to do the, the defending, but we don't have to keep going up and down. So yeah, let's get that. Oh, this is very good. We're building a lift. Okay, this is brilliant. Okay, right, that's really, really helpful. That's very, very good. Okay, so now we just want to see how it works. So let's dig up like this. Ah, right, I see. We have to keep digging down that kind of central column to make the lift work. Okay, that's fine. Can we find some resources? No, and we might need to... Oh, hang on. There are some resources, but I think they're going to have to wait. We need to go up and do some defending. Ah, oh, if only we had a shield of some description. That would help, wouldn't it? Uh, right, okay, battle mode. Here we go. Let's defend against some beasties. Right, shoot you and shoot you both. Ah, good. You both are sort of attacked from the same direction, which helps. Right there from over this side. Probably going to get some flying things at some point. Right, the dome's going to take some hits. Ow. Oh, crikey. They're, they're, they're coming from all sides now. Right. So there we go. They're back on this side. Oh, the dome's taking a proper kick in. Right. Quick, 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 quick. Kill, kill you, kill you, kill you. Away with you, baddies. I think that's it. And I think what we do is we immediately go to here and we do that repair. We repair the dome because it was looking a little bit... Oh, it's still a bit flaky. It's still a little bit kind of broken looking. But okay. Right. Here we go. Let's go and see... Here we go. There's a thing over here, wasn't there? Uh, so if we just go and grab this, just dig that, dig that. Okay. So if we grab these three things and then we just kind of fly over to the middle, they just automatically whoosh upwards. Is that what happens? Uh, yeah. Okay, it's a bit slow, but it will get there. Okay, it's not quite as fast as I thought. But yeah, that means we can stay down here and those goods will eventually make their way up to the top, which is very good. But yeah, we have to remember to give ourselves enough time now to get to the top. Right, green stuff. Green stuff is important. It's really difficult getting the green stuff. It's really tricky. 
It takes ages to dig it through on this level now. Um, oh, there's loads of stuff over here. Okay, right. That Oh, that's very tricky to get a hold of. Okay. We're going to pull all of this stuff over here into the lift. <laughs> and then we're going to get up to the top. And hopefully we can get there in time. Right. Okay. Yeah. Drop all of that. There you go. It's all in the lift. So, yeah. Where's our other stuff? Has it made it to the top? It's just making it to the top. Okay. that That's brilliant. I like that. Right. And now we're ready for another fight with the aliens. No, not the aliens. The locals. Right. Okay. So, you're coming in from the left. And, ooh. Oh right, that's that's a big that's a big chunky boy. Okay, right, fine. They've bought they've bought the big guns in. Oh, and there's a flying thing. Hang on, right. Destroy the little one. Destroy the little one. Right, the big one is going to cause us some problems, but so are the flying things. Right, destroy the flying things first because they're causing us all sorts of problems. Back round to this. Oh my word. Ah, oh, we got it just in time. Crikey. Oh no, no, it no, we haven't got it. <laughs> It's drilling into the thing. Away with you. How rude. Okay, we've got a lift now. Can you work? Could you just go away? Thank you so much. Ah, right. I think that's that sorted. I think our dome has seen better days. Hang on, hang on. I think we might need to do a repair of the dome and a repair of the dome. Uh, yeah, there we go. It sort of looks not quite as utterly broken. Right. The resources are slowly floating up. I like that. I like our lift. It's very nice. Right, and then we do have... Some more green bits over here. Okay, so let's try and get these out whilst we can. There we go. Diggity dig. Oh, only one green bit out of there. Boo. Right, four out of there, though. That's not so bad. Right, and then dig up here. Just because there might be stuff over here on the left that we've not seen. Uh, in fact, how far does this go to the left? Oh, crikey. I thought we are at the edge. Oh, we're nowhere near the edge. Oh, there's more green stuff. Okay. <laughs> I thought we were at the very edge, but no, we are clearly not. That was nonsense and piffle. Oh, right. The good thing about this is that there is a lot of green stuff. The only thing is, I don't think I'm going to have time to pick it all up and move it. Uh, okay, right. Can we grab all of the green stuff? Are we able to get that? Oh, this is going to be pushing it a little bit. This is going to be pushing it. <laughs> okay, drop. Drop one of the bits. We can't get all of the bits. Oh, there we go. We pull them all through. Right, and as we fly up, we're just going to drop them. There we go. Like that. We need to get up and defend really, really quickly. Right, there we go. We're in we're in defense mode. Maximum defense mode. Right. Okay. So shooty, shooty little monsters on the floor. Shooty you, shooty. I expect we're gonna see another one of the um the big lads at some point. The big chunky boys, they'll be in at some point. Right, so flying thing, kill one flying thing. Oh, other flying thing is going in that direction. Right, kill the flying thing. Is that it? That can't be it. I don't believe it, game. Lies, I tell you. Lies and tricks. Okay, so a load of green things are going to make their way up to the top. Look at that. We're going to have so many green things. It's going to be wonderful. Uh, right, okay, so then grab those two. And let's pop those into the uh, the magic sort of uh, lift thingamajig as well. Uh, just take that out because we can. There we go. Uh, and then we'll dig over here. Oh, hang on. It's widening at the bottom. Oh, that's why I thought we're at the edge. Right, so as you dig deeper, the sort of, the, the, the I don't know, the cave system, whatever, the ground kind of opens up a little bit. Ah, okay, right. That's very intriguing. Okay, so if we get rid of that and then, what if we just dig down? Can we just find some useful stuff? That'd be quite handy, wouldn't it? If we could just find some stuff underneath the lift and the lift would just automatically sort of take it. If we just dig down really far with the lift... Just dig, dig, dig. See how deep we can get. We might need to make our drill slightly more effective because it's taking a very long time. <laughs> taking a ve very long time. Right. Okay. So let's keep digging. And are we finding anything useful in this particular bit? Right. We need to go back up to the top on the lift. I mean, we could just sit on the lift. We could just get a nice little free ride, I suppose. But there we go. Right. The final green thing has gone in. So I think we'll prepare for battle. And then we'll treat ourselves to some upgrades. That'll be quite nice for us. So kill that thing. There we go. Back around this way. Ah, right. One of the big lads is here. So we need to cause some damage to that. But now there's a flying thing. We need to destroy that as well. Because the flying things are annoying. Right, flying thing gone. Right, little things are getting us. The moons, I've just noticed, have got slightly sinister faces on them. They've kind of got weird kind of skull face type things on them. Right, and then just shoot this thing. Does it make a difference where we shoot it? And 
Yep, it's got a big kind of stabby tail drill. Oh no, the dome is looking terrible. We need to repair the dome. The dome is cracking. Right, we need to destroy this laser. Oh, crikey. Is, <laughs> is that it? Right, okay. We need to upgrade, uh, sorry, repair the dome. Probably on multiple. Yeah, we need to do it again, I think. I think we need to do it again. I think it's still a bit broken. Okay. Um, and then, could we do some upgrade? Oh, the lift. We can upgrade the lift. Crikey. Okay, can we make the stun laser a bit better? So, damage. So, now we can spend two green and one round thing to make the stun laser cause damage. And then we could spend six green things and one... Ooh... We need the square things to repair the um, to repair the dome. Okay, we'll make it move faster, and we'll make it uh, cool down faster and shoot for longer. There we go. That's very good. And let's get the lift going. Ah, the lift also lifts you up. Oh yeah, we'll take that and we'll make the lift quicker as well. Uh, and then we need oh we need two we need two more green things to make um to make the drill quicker. Okay, that's fine. We can work on that. We can get that sorted. But there we go. So we've made things a little bit better. So now, yeah, do we, are we fly up the lift now? That's wonderful. Okay, so here we go. Let's see what we can find. And we haven't looked over here, look. Might be all sorts of exciting goodies over this side. So let's kind of tunnel our way over to the right here, just in the hope that we uncover some shiny goodies. How long have we got left? We've got quite a long time, actually. We've got loads of time for the next sort of uh, the next incursion of the locals. So there we go, some green. Oh, there's loads of green stuff. This is very good. Okay, right, green stuff. Green stuff, so much green stuff. Okay, so we'll grab all of this. That's got to be good. So can we grab it all and move? No, we can't. We've got no chance of doing that. Right, we'll just sort of bring that much along. So there you go. And we can pop all that in the lift. So just like that. Oh, hang on a minute. No, you get in the lift. And then we need to go back down really quickly. But the lift is doing things quicker. Because then we've got all these other green things. So grab all of those. Plus, grab that one as we go by. And then we need to go up in the lift as well. So hang on. We could, if we're going up anyway, we could just take these up with us. Oh, we need to get there really quickly. Quick. <laughs> Monsters are coming. Right, there we go. Battle mode. I think we got there just about in time. We could do with upgrading the um, the actual laser itself. Although the stun laser is now moving around pretty sharpish. Look at that. The stun laser is doing a grand job. Well done, stun laser. And it's causing damage as well, which is handy. Oh, they're going from side to side. We need another laser. We need a third laser to cover the other side that we're not reaching. Right. Is it just a load of ground troops this time? Is that it? I'm a bit suspicious of that game. Uh, okay, fine. Apparently that's kind of it. Right, so if we then uh, if we pop into there and do some upgrades. Okay, I think we repair the dome again. But now we really do need some of that cobalt stuff. Uh, and then, yeah, what have we got? 16. 16 uh, green things. How about we make... Oh, now do we do the drill or do we do the actual laser? We're going to make the laser better. The laser has to be a little bit better. I mean, 20. 20 green things means we can have a double laser. Okay, that's very exciting. Okay, maybe if we get that far, we'll give that a go. Right, okay. We have an entire kind of round, if you like, until more monsters appear. So where did we get to over here? Um, hang on. Tunnel through this bit. That's fine. Did we look over here? Right, okay. So that's the top. So there's nothing over there. So then we just need to dig down like this. There might be something across here that could be handy. And then we'll tunnel through this. But yeah, we've still got three quarters of our time left. And we've got the lovely lift in the middle, which is very helpful. Okay, so we're not finding anything. Yeah, we need more square things. It's the technical term that all space people use. <laughs> we need more square things. But um, but yeah, because that repairs the dome. And I think, ah, aha, is this a square thing? Um, no, ah, that's an, another upgradey thing. Okay, that's good. You know what? We will take that. We'll do that now because that might come in helpful. So, right. Lob that up into there. Um, a shield or a prospection meter. A meter showing the distance to the nearest resources will also show directions with upgrades. Um, okay. Now, this is tricky because that would be really handy. The prospection meter would be really useful so we can go and dig in the right place. But a shield obviously will be really handy for making sure that we don't die. I think, 
let's get let's get the meter thing. Let's get that in. Let's do away with the shield. Now the only thing is, how does this work? How on earth does this work? Does it pop up on the screen or what? I've got no idea. Ah, right, hang on a minute. Hang on. That, the green, there's a little thing by the green sort of thing there, which has appeared. So it's showing us that, hang on, it's in this direction. There's green stuff in this direction, I think. Um, oh no, oh no, hang on, there's aliens. <laughs> Ah, uh, get up in the lift. Okay, right, stun laser, do your job. Uh, hang on, quick. <laughs> uh, I, I kind of forgot about that. Oh, yeah, there's aliens. Yeah, right, there we go. Best sort them out. Okay, right, hang on. You you go down. Oh, many flying things. Many flying things. Oh, no, now there's you. Right, hang on. Zap the flying things, because they're causing us some problems. Okay, so zap you. Right, little laser, you you deal with the things on that side. Right, I'm coming round. Oh, the dome is in an absolute state. Okay, right, hang on. Blast that, blast that. Yeah. Okay, sort of forgot about the aliens. There. Right, okay, can we use our last square thing to repair the dome? That's it. That's the last time we can repair the dome. Oh, the dome is looking very rickety. Oh, dear. Um. Okay, so I assume, yeah, we can only at the minute sort of prospect for the green things. So, yeah, it's got to be around here somewhere. There we go. Right, so get that. That's a that's great. That's taking a long time to dig through the green things. Okay, so dig through this. Any more green things? No, doesn't look like there's more green things now. So that's not many, is it? That's not a lot of green things at all. Right, let go of all of those. Um, okay, do we head in that direction? Because there's now a little sort of... A little thing by oh no hang on not like that i think it's over in this direction let's not forget to actually you know sort of um go and defend the the dome this time because that was a bit silly wasn't it kind of forgot about that never mind right can we get some green things is there a green thing over here somewhere it looks like if we dig through this we might get some green things here we go here we go can we get one lot it's gonna be really hard to dig this out dig quicker little diggy person and diggy diggy hole. One bit. One bit. Oh dear. Okay, right. Hang on a minute. We'll just fly up with it. Fly up in the lift. Wee. Oh no. We're really far away. <laughs> and quick. Get there and get there. Right. Battle mode. Okay. They're coming in from this place. Right. Oh, that's... Ah, right. Okay. Well, nothing else is in. Cause as much damage to that as we can. Uh, right. Hang on a minute. Cause damage to the flying things because they are a problem. Ah, oh, the dome is taking a proper kick in. Right, stun laser did a good job. That stopped that thing from hitting us. Right, fire a laser in that thing's face. Okay, here we go. It's got weird tentacly bits. Oh. Oh. Okay. Right, okay. Quickly, back down we go. <laughs> I quite like this. This is good. This is very intriguing. Right, back down we go. And let's see if we can't uncover some more useful green things. Now, I like how previously we were sort of digging... Just, you know, digging everything because we could. Now we've got little sort of tunnels appearing because it just takes forever to dig things. Right, more green stuff. This is really good. We like the green stuff. We do need to make our drill better. I can't... Oh, there's so much green stuff. Okay, right. But yeah, we could do with making our drill slightly more effective. <laughs> there's a lot of drilling going on. Oh, wow. Much in the way of green stuff. Okay, so if we just dig out this entire great big kind of vein of the green... Then, um, yeah, that means we can haul it all the way back into the lift. And then we can go do some fighting again. Are we going to have time to get that final one down here? That's going to take quite a while, I imagine, to get sorted. Uh, because it's even deeper. Is there going to be any more green after that, possibly? It's been a bit greedy there, I think. Uh, we'll grab uh, a couple of bits like that. And then can we grab another couple of bits? Oh, no, I think we might have overreached ourselves. Hang on a minute. Just, yep, just chuck that in there and back up to the top quick. <laughs> quick, monsters, monster baddies, baddie monsters coming in and boop, right, we're here, we're ready. The dome is looking absolutely shot to pieces. Okay, right, get, destroy whatever that is just there, get rid of that. Right, flying thing, come round, destroy the flying thing, destroy you. There's another flying thing. However, the stun laser did a great job there. That did a grand job. Right, and then you, blast you. Oh, there's a thing on the side. It's hurting the dome. Right, destroy that one there. That one sort of exploded a bit. The dome is looking very rickety. I think... I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay. We really do need to find the other stuff 
We need to find a square thing to repair the dome because the dome is in a bad way. It's in a very bad way. Okay, right. Grab all of the green stuff. Grab all of the green stuff. We just chuck that into the um, into the lift thing of a jig. So there we go, like that. We've got any more? Yep, a couple more. Right, so they can all float up, which is fine. We'll grab, oi, grab you. Thank you. Grab all of those things. Put all of these in. <laughs> oh no. Right. They all need to go in like that. Wonderful. Right, and then we can fly all the way back up. And I think what we'll do is we'll go and upgrade our drill thing, because it's taking forever. It's taking so long <laughs> to just dig things. So the drill strength is going to be a bit quicker, which is fine. Um, have we got anything else that we can upgrade? Ah, here we go. So the prospection meter, you can upgrade uh, water. Oh, is that what the round stuff is? Ah, it's water, cobalt, and iron. Ah, right, okay, now we've got a little bit of that. Okay, that's quite handy. Um, and the stun laser. Oh, we can't upgrade this at all. We could do speed two. We could make the stun laser move a little bit quicker. Um, yeah, okay, we'll do that. That seems like a worthwhile investment. Um, and then if we come out of that, so how good is our drill now? So we've upgraded the drill. Some more green things going our way. Very good. So if we just go over that way, Okay, that's pretty good. Can we find anything? <laughs> We've got to go back up and defend. I suspect if we take too many more hits, that's going to be it. The dome is going to crack and it's going to be game over. But, I mean, you know, we gave it a pretty good shot. Here we go. Let's just see if we can find anything over here. Uh, no, we have to get back. We've got to get back quickly. Possibly left it slightly too long. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Up in the super speedy elevator lift thingamajig. We oh, crikey. We're really deep down there. Right. The dome is looking absolutely obliterated <laughs> Okay, right, stun laser. Yep, yeah, you're doing a good job. And, oh my word, there's a, there's a thing. Oh, hang on a minute, there's one coming up for that door. Right, the dome has broken. The game is over, and the, the good guys have won. Let's, let's be honest. <laughs> the good guys have taken a glorious victory there, and they've repelled the evil invaders who are digging other resources out of their planet. But there we go. So keep one gadget. Your battle is over, but you can keep one gadget to reuse in your next run. Which one should it be? Stun laser, lift, prospection meter, or nothing? Oh, I like that. That's quite nice. Um, I think, I mean, which was most useful? The stun laser. The stun laser was the most useful, so we would carry that on. Well, there we go. And then you try again, but then you would have the stun laser from early on, and then that might help you do a little bit better, because yeah, you can defend yourself easier from the start. Um, I mean, yeah, do we get a new dome? Let's just go and have a quick check. Do we get a new dome? No, we do not. Okay, never mind. Um, well, there we go. There we go. I don't know how to get back from this now. Hang on. There we go. Um, that was really good. I like that. That was very, very enjoyable. It was very different. I can't remember a game where it's, you know, combined mining and then kind of like a dome defense thing. But, yeah, I like all the different upgrades you can have and there's different strategies you can kind of deploy and all that kind of stuff. And there is a bit of a balance between making your character a little bit more effective so they can dig quicker and move around faster. And then, you know, having your mining operations improved by the lift. And then also improving your weaponry and the dome and all that kind of stuff. That was really good. That was very, very enjoyable. And, you know, given that was a demo, that was really good. So, yeah, we might keep our eyes on this. We shall keep our eye on it and see what happens with this. And maybe at some point in the future, when it's a little bit more developed or whatever, when, you know, it's not an early demo build, when it's slightly more sort of polished, we'll come back to it and have another little dabble with Dome Romantic. But yes, we shall finish up for now. Hopefully you did enjoy this. If you did, please do leave a like. That would be most marvellous indeed. And also, if you're not already, then please do subscribe to keep up to date with all the other bits and bobs that we get up to in the Geek Cupboard. But for now, thank you very much for joining me in the Geek Cupboard, and I will see you next time. I just want to point out the danger of blasting fire into the face of somebody who has not got any kind of headgear on. Let's suppress the pants off that thing. I always knew hiding on a park bench would be no good. Oh no, it's a terrifying disc thing. The aliens shoot him with such force <laughs> that he loses his hair, which is just ridiculous.